Although, albeit, he isn't not hard whatsoever. So let's just keep moving forward. Bunch of um random encounters here, so just keep going. And keep going. Hopefully it ends. Nope, guess not. Okay, so not very hard whatsoever. Just use your basic strategies. Well, I guess they were good. I got 16 TP out of everything. Um, let's get the chest first before we can, before we talk to Ozzy. Okay, we got a mist robe. Let's um actually when when you fight when you fight um Magus, take her with you. Because um he has barriers, magical barriers, which make having Marl not so effective to have. So um I think Miss. Yeah, okay. No, keep tape invest because having fire resistance will actually be pretty useful. Now, as for Ozzy, let's just. Uh, I'll just show you. I grow tired of this. Slash! Flee! Sorry, Ozzy, but they can't help you now. You fly eating tongue flicking. Oz. Ozzy's in. A jam! Thou cannot run. So just keep chasing after him and. Yeah, um, this doesn't look. It's very easy, as you can see. Very simple. Welcome. Thank you. Okay. So just, I guess. Ah, it hurt me. <laughs> oh, it hurts so much. Not. Okay. So let's just quit. <laughs> I guess I equip dark mail on. Hmm. Magic defense plus five. Yeah, I equip dark mail on Cron. Maybe Chrono. Let's equip it on you. Should. No, give it to Frog and keep um Ruby vest on. What's his face? I totally forgot his name already. Um, yeah, keep Ruby Vest on Chrono. Keep Dark Meal on Frog. It's just to cut the fire the fire damage. Mwa, how's this? Yeah, just it's just to keep the fire damage to a minimum when you fight Magus. Okay, this death trap was pretty horrible. What the? Impossible. Not really. It's okay, so Ozzy's basically a joke now. It's it's really personally it, it's rather embarrassing okay I do believe it is actually um, no what am I doing <laughs> it's Robo who gets Doomfinger there we go all right so bam there we go now can I take Luca or or uh, Robo to fight to fight um, Magus it doesn't matter so anyways um go ahead and just fight these bats they're not hard um, yeah to avoid these just easy <laughs> I know this is basically just reminiscent of Donkey Kong it's not hard it's very simple, so just yeah. Stick around down here. As long as you don't move, you won't get hit. So, poof, you're good. And yeah, I don't understand. As a boss, Ozzy, like who leads them, it's pretty lame. Ah, shoot. Oh no. Oh boy. We just got trapped by decadence. Let us try and survive this very incredibly hard battle. Oh man. Personally, I'm a little annoyed at how how weak decadents are. I mean, like in other RPGs, when you fight the undead, they're they're um, incredibly strong. I don't understand how they're incredibly strong, but they are. Okay, so there's nothing else here except four save points in each each section of the room. So one, two, uh, tra and get. So there you go. Get the, get all the chests. There are no enemies in the chest, so. Um, have fun. So there's Lapis, a mid ether, uh, barrier, which will reduce magical damage. And, da -da 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 -da, and, okay. So, now what you're gonna wanna do is heal up because th those four, those four save points, two of them are not, are not real save points. Um, one of them, yeah, two of them are not real save points. They will actually get you into a battle, which incredibly is not hard whatsoever. And one of them will take you out of the trap here. And let's see. And one of them will, will be a real save point. So, yeah. Easy peasy. Not hard. So, I'm just going to try and determine which ones are are the monsters. Let's go up here. Is this a monster? Oh, yeah. It's the monster. So, basic attack. It should not be very hard. Um... 18, see, as you can tell. But uh, I wanna try and do this fast, so we'll wipe them out. Um, there you go, lightning, lightning. Actually, I hope this works. I've, I didn't actually, um, I don't even know if there was, there, if there was this magic, but uh, apparently they're not, so that's good. So they're incredibly easy. It's a good spot to, do, I guess, get a little bit extra experience. I don't know if they're high on TP, I'm not certain. It's 432, 
60 p yeah, okay so they're good for experience and also i don't always stick with 65 million bc being the best place to farm tp as of right now uh, i don't know if there's anything um better than that but yeah okay so on the right is your is where you leave and yeah just go ahead and prick okay so that's an enemy this will probably be an enemy there will be a save point down here don't even worry about saving i'm, I'm being completely honest with you oh it changed damn okay so just enemy there and here's a telepod <laughs> i guess uh transmat so let's try and avoid more traps because I, I really don't want to fall down oh are you kidding me Ah, curse you. Okay, so let, let's see if I'm right. No, okay. It doesn't go clock, counterclockwise. Yes, alright. So, up. So, right down, up. Gotcha. Okay. Let's try. Oh. World is never in. Okay, so now that you know where all the tra now that you know where the traps are, you should not be able to fall through them, right? <laughs> Hopefully. Oh, more enemies. This will never end. Let's try the one on the left again. Alright, look at that. Second time is always a charm apparently with me. So let's go this way. Go down. Work our way back up into another freaking hole. My god, come on. Okay, let's try up. Come on, first time's a charm. Damn. Ooh, I guess falling down actually had some perks to it. So what I got was Leaf Slash and... Da, 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 da. Ah, here we go. Red Pin. Burn enemies with Flame Slash. That is cool. I think I got another one. Ah, Spire. Yes, attack enemy with Spire. I don't know what that means, but... It must. It sounds pretty cool. And man, Chrono can like fusion dance with everybody. Awesome. Second time's a charm. Like I'm, I'm a damn magician. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna put it out there. I'm a magician. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Come on. Oh. Oh man, these guys are really hurting me. Ooh, I found the save point. All right. Well, might as well save, right? Okay. So I'm just gonna put it out there. The hardest part about um, about the Aussie boss fight is starting the Aussie boss fight. This is not fun whatsoever. Urgh. What the impossible? Oh my god, this guy's such a loser. Okay. Uh, so you can avoid the you can avoid the battles by easily peasling. Um, just oh no, what the hell happened here? Ah, so it's basically dynamite. Got it. And very weak dynamite at that. Physical defensive on. Hmm. Well. Oh, oh, yes. Sorry about that, guys. Um, that's so stupid. I totally forgot to mention. Okay, so this, um, the dude who's flying up there, I think he is juggler. What you have to do is, um, he'll alternate between physical defenses and magical defenses. So what you're going to have to do is use... Uh, a magic attack first because he starts physical def he starts with a physical resistance and then next you will use a physical attack and then you will use a magical attack as you can see now he's getting hit for full damage so yeah alternately when you see that guy magic attack then physical then magic and physical R rinse and repeat the entire the entire um series and easily easily be able to win okay so as long as you don't move these guys? Well, actually, not these guys. Um, it's the roly polies that are the pain. But these guys, yeah, these guys are pretty easy to kill, as you can plainly see. I'm only keeping these in here because um, cutting them would be a little bit tedious because it's just. Oh, I can't. Oh, jeez. I don't mind um, cutting, doing cuts here and there, but when there's so many of them, like, especially with random encounters, and I know I can avoid them. Then it's just it's it's horribly irritating. Like cu cutting all, doing cuts, uh, transitions, um, editing. I, I enjoy it, but I don't enjoy having to like watch every the um, entire video over. Well, not over and over, but watch the entire video again and sit here. So yeah, um, while I'm editing, when I'm the finished product, I enjoy watching, but not the not the editing section. So let's uh take this guy down before he decides to explode and you are resistant to physical or resistant to magic so let's smash him down oh okay then that was a complete accident I guess blowing him up will automatically cause him to detonate 
Although he's not very strong, so it's always a perk. Okay, so like I said, the hardest part of fighting Ozzy is getting to fight Ozzy. And as you can plainly see, it's taking quite a long time. Getting a little irritated. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, here, I think we can find him, fight him. Okay then, guess not. Oh, I think we get into a bunch more random encounters. Very, very tedious. What the? Impossible! Dude, just fight me already. I'm getting very bored of all these random encounters. Ugh. Grr, this takes the cake. One speed belt. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna give that to Luca. Let's see. Where is it? Ah, oh, here we go. Alright, there we go. So, if you're low on MP, if you're low on health, I wouldn't bother really, because Ozzy is just a joke boss battle. Good god! Still more random encounters. One will end. I think all these random encounters are meant to fatigue the player. Because, yeah, I'm getting fatigued here. <gasps> no way! I avoided them. Oh, awesome. All right, so, pro tip, guys. Something I just realized. Run run at the edges. Run at the edges to avoid these, hor these horribly redundant battles. Maybe I <laughs> go this way. Ooh, look at that. Mist robe, okay. I don't... Actually, let's see if it has a special ability. Uh, do, 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 do. Here we go. No, nope. okay, so it's just um, high defensive capabilities. Magic scarf. What does that do again? Oh, yeah, increases magical attack. Okay, so let's just do this. Bonk. Hello, Ozzy. Urg. Thy, thy time hath cometh, Ozzy. Ha ha ha. I'm sure Sir Magus has already called for reinforcements. Wait until Lavos arrives. I shan't be defeated. No form of attack will break my barrier. Uh, well, he's right. Um, now, just attack the... <laughs> attack the switches. Ha 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 ha. Hmm. So, one of these switches will cause... Um, Whatever, you know, you guys will just see. I'm sure you can figure it out. Watch where you're aiming. Gwa ha 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 ha. One more. One left. I know he keeps laughing. It's, it's kind of lame. Like, I'm not even kidding. This is a total joke boss battle. <laughs> it's kind of amusing though, but yeah. Uh, all that, all that, all those fights just to get here and just to watch this happen. <laughs> Jeez. See you later, Ozzy. Now, I don't know if the barrier broke or not, but Ozzy's gone, so that's happened. That's good. That guy was totally bent. Even she knows. We must hurry to Magus' this place. Yeah, I don't... Do one of them take me to, um... I hope one of them takes me to uh, Magus' place. So just um, use shelter, um, save, just in case, because... Actually, I'm, I'm just going to save, just in case I, I totally forgot to do something. Okay, so left, it will take you to here. Now what you can do is you can actually fight the bats to increase your experience, to get, more, to get some experience before the battle. And if you don't move, they won't attack you. No, wait, no, it's totally wrong, they'll attack you. So what you can do is use Cyclone, and if you happen to miss one, like I thought I did, then... Yeah, like they're incredibly easy. Uh, six vampire bats. Yep, dead, dead, and gone. Three hundred forty-eight experience points, twelve tech points. So, oh, look at that life. Okay, so um, you can go straight back to the save point and just rinse and repeat this entire battle. I would just um, if you if you are going to farm the experience, once you leave, run all the way back down so they all like basically pile onto the screen, and then you'll be able to. You'll be able to um, fight them all at once instead of one at a time. Although I'm not certain if um, you do can fight them one at a time, but we'll, we'll have to see. All right, here we are, the Battle of Magus, Nuga Ziana Zeberzom. No, <laughs> I was just waiting for something to happen. Okay, whoa, this is eerie. I am not running. This is pretty cool. Now the chosen time has come. Oh, look at all those flames. 
this game epic or scary. Exchange this world for what the? It can't be. It's Dracula. No, wait. Just kidding. It's Majus. Majus. It's that stupid frog. <laughs> Kissed any princesses lately? Oh, what a lame joke, dude. I rather enjoy this form, and I owe it all to you. I have something for you. Whoa, this is epic finale. Ah, the Masamune. I bet you're just dying to use it. Oh, he doesn't look scared at all. The black wind begins to blow. Okay, give me your best shot. Blah, 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 blah. If you're not, if you're prepared, just damn, I didn't read fast enough. Oh, okay. Let's pause this because I can, I won't be able to fight this guy and explain to you. Um, his, the, his, basically his attacks, his defenses, his statistics. So, his HP is 6,666. Now, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to lie. This is going to be a pain in the ass battle. Trust me on this. So 6,666 HP, he, his weaknesses, his strengths, they will vary. And, I, and I'll explain to you why in a second. Um, it's recommended that you're at least level 25. Now, that just got, that just proves that you, you guys should know that it's going to be a tough fight. He'll drop 1,500 experience, TP 15, uh, 3,000 gold. Now, he has all the elemental attacks at their level 2 form. So lightning, ice, fire will all be level 2. Um, lightning will deal 150. Ice will deal 100, fire will deal 150. Now the problem with that is they're gonna hit. It's gonna hit everybody. So I would be incredibly careful here. Shadow bomb, it'll hit um, one of your party members for 100, 150. Be careful with that. Well, not be careful with that one. That one should be easier to manage because it only hit one person. He has an ability. He also has an ability called dark matter. It'll hit for 250 shadow damage to the entire party. Now his other attack is. Um, geyser HP down, which he'll use quite often. It'll hit you for 70 damage. Now, if you can, have Frog continually continually use heal. And he, he also has another ability. It's it's a basic slash attack, which will hit you for 75 damage. Okay, the one a saving grace for most of you guys will be that he has a, he has a magical berry that will resist all magic, except for one type. Now, when he casts... Um, when he activates his magical barrier... If he starts casting fire, that means his barrier is vulnerable to fire. If he cast, starts casting ice, his barrier is vulnerable to ice and lightning and shadow, respectively, okay? So whatever elemental, whatever element he uses to cast, to attack you with, that is what he's weak against. Now beware that once you use, um, a spell on him, he'll, he'll most likely immediately change it, but sometimes he won't. Just keep that in mind, he won't. If you want to force a change in a barrier, use, um, a physical attack from whoever just be careful because he'll attack with um i think death bomb or something death death matter or dark dark matter yeah that's it he'll he should attack with dark matter which will hit you for 250 so it's pretty um risky to do that unless you have frog immediately able to to um heal so just keep that in mind okay guys um a little mistake i need to correct here um when you attack him to change his barrier he will not cast dark matter um so just he'll he'll, he'll cast the the elemental spell that he activated his barrier for. All right, so now that we know that, um, what you can do is the strategy with this is to use Frog to attack to attack Magus, which will lower his magical defense. Okay, and then you're gonna want to pummel hit him once with one with your elemental attack, duh, and just continually repeat that and make sure to keep your HP. Hmm. Pretty high, okay? Especially if you don't have Morrow, because Morrow could have cast Haste. But, yeah. Just keep your attack up. Uh, I Just to keep my attack up, I, I brought Luca with me to, to um, hit with her fire. Because Chrono has Lightning, Frog, Water, Luca with fire. If you, use, if you bring in Morrow, it's basically going to be Ice and Water. Since they're technically the same element, you're going to lose out on one attack for the barrier. So that'll reduce your attacks per turn. Okay, so Protect is useless. Don't do it. Um, when he's, when the status bar reads, um, well, what's it called again? May just risks casting, casting a spell. He's going to cast dark matter, which will hit you, which would, which will hit you for 
which will hit your entire party members for 250 HP da 250 damage. So keep that in mind. Okay. Once that happens, heal before and heal immediately afterwards because he can wipe you out pretty fast that way. Okay, so now let's just get started here since I'm getting a little bored myself of talking. All right, so first off, first off, first off, um, what guys are HP down? Okay, so I'm gonna first use Frog to attack, then I'm going to use him to keep an. Ask me to increase magic, magical defense. Okay, so he hasn't cast. Um, I don't think he's cast a barrier yet. I have problems with him um, looking upwards at, at um. Yeah, add things. Okay, so it looks like barrier change only water damages. Okay, so now that you know that, you can use your ice to attack your water. So use your water. There you go. I'm just gonna use protect because it's I don't want to like get punched by his slash attack, which isn't very fun. So as you can see, um, shadow damage, shadow damage. That would be for Robo. Ah, okay, so I'm getting hit for 100. It's it's not horrible, but um, it's better than getting hit with the other attacks because they'll hit each and every one of your party members. Okay, so Geyser's not very fun either. Hmm. Okay, I'm just gonna cast protect on everybody. I'm just gonna um, I'm gonna continue playing this battle until um, he he pretty much casts all his stuff. So yeah, just keep it for now. Now I'm gonna. I want. I need to force his, his force a barrier change. So there we go. Um, water damage. Here comes ice two. And frog. Uh, no, nah, I should be perfectly fine. So one more water attack. And then we'll see what he has. If he if he casts fire, then I'll use um fire sword. Lightning damage. Okay. You know what? Use lightning two. And then hopefully I don't get killed because I. Okay, good, 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 good. I can't. I, I don't. I don't particularly enjoy this. The fact that um, these command the command bars block ugh, are blocking my HP. It's hard. I, I don't know who's low on health and who's not. Okay, good. At least he survived. Okay, let's heal up here. Um, damn it! Just in case, um, he's dead. No? Okay, good. Okay, so he's using Shadow right now, so... Oh, Jesus, see? Ugh, it makes it so difficult to do anything. Um, Fire only, okay. It makes it so difficult to manage your HP when you can't see it. That's... That is... Ugh, one of the only problems I have with this. Okay, so... Oh, damn it. Oh, look, that, he survived, okay. So note for you guys is that um, what you want to do, what you want to pay attention to is when uh, Magus says, he's, when Magus risks casting a spell, what you're going to want to do is, um, no, I mean, um, oh, well, I told you what I was going to say here. Only fire damage? Okay. Okay, so if I remember, I'll let you guys know. But until then, yeah, see, this is where the ruby vest comes in handy. It's pretty low. Um, it re it'll reduce the fire damage by 50%. Okay, so let's just keep that there. Okay, so um, it looks like this is all I can do so far. So um, I'm just just continue watching, and you'll see how the strategy works out here.
Oh, okay. I need to cut him for a second. Okay. So when he says risk, uh, risks um, casting a spell, he has no barrier. So all use your powerful attacks at this point if you can. And um, yeah, use your most powerful attacks as you can. Shoot. Okay. Yeah. And here's his dark matter attack. It's going to hit pretty hard. So make sure you have heal up right afterwards. And yeah, there you go. Okay. So just wait until his barrier comes up. It should come up soon. And that is the entire strategy. So yeah. When he risks everything on his spell, hit him with everything as fast as you can. If you have haste, perfect for you guys. If you don't, then... Ah, there you go. Okay, so we're going to do it again. Uh, leap slash. So I'm going to just uh, keep healing here. It's, it's almost over the battle. That's why he's starting to use this. When he's low on HP, this one he'll start using it. Um, his risking his dark matter spell. So I'm just—I guess I'll just keep this and just try and talk a bit more about whatever. Okay, so this might be it here. No. Wow. Okay. Dark matter. All right. Time to heal up. Now, personally, I'm glad he's using multiple times because Frog, um, he's quick enough to heal twice in that about 200, 280, no, he heal about three times before an attack. So, yeah, he, sh he should be able to bring everybody at back to full health before Dark Matter hits. Okay, so, wow. What is he doing again? Okay, let's have him do this. Yeah, there we go. It's over. 15 tech points, 3,000 gold. Frog levels up. Yep, of course. Good, good, good. <clears throat> All right. It looks like we stopped the uh, summoning of Lavos. I think, anyways. I'm not exactly certain. What have you done to the Massimune? Hmm. Looks like something happened. What's happening? Could it be Lavos? Oh, shit. Bad timing. Don't wake up on me now. What do you mean? Didn't you create him? Oh, okay. Um, before we continue with the storyline, if if Mages beats you, you will actually get a different. You actually get an ending. So yeah. Um. Oops. <laughs> but you can always just reload because I told you to say before the battle with Lavos. So yeah, if you want to see the ending, reload. Go to Lavos. Um, go to Mages here and die. And yeah, you'll get a new end. You'll get an ending. What do you mean? Didn't you create him? You fools! I only summoned him. He lives in the inner earth, absorbing the land's powers and growing ever stronger. So he wasn't born in this period. Interesting. What's going on? A gate! It's huge! You! If you hadn't shown up, we're being drawn in! Whoa! Holy sh crap! Oh, too much pixels! Too much pixels! Pixelitis! Ah! Oh, that's pretty crazy. I'm getting a little dizzy here. Oh, man. That's one big gate. Holy crap. Even mages got absorbed. I wonder where they went, actually. Uh, Millennial Fair? Guardia Castle? Chrono. Hmm. I wonder where, really where they are. Ah, Chrono. Wake up, Chrono. Oh, look, he's back home. Honey, you'll be late for work. Oh, okay, I'm confused now. Uh, I'd forgotten how beautiful Lean's bell could sound. Right, right, okay. Chrono, we can't keep sponging off my dad. Get out and get a job. Uh. Hmm, okay. I guess we beat the game. <laughs> if only that were true. Chrono, 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 Chrono. Oh god, I don't want to keep repeating that. It's pretty annoying. Okay, Isla. Oh, look, we're in the past. Fascinating. Chrono, awake? Isla? Isla had a strange dream. Went to Mystic Mountain. Everyone lie there hurt. I carry back to hut. Hmm, huh, where's Magus? Yummy frog for Isla eat? <laughs> what the fuck? But perish the thought loss. By the way, wither the blue haired one. Only find you there. Blue haired one more tasty? We hath lost him. 
May just said that Lavos was born in the distant past. No, he didn't. Lavos? Not worry now, you rest hurt bad. Okay, thanks, Isla. Pretty interesting. Yay, wonderful music to help me sleep. Hey, it's Kino. Quano, okay now? Isla, busy, look for Laruba village. Fight reptites together. Destroy reptites or we no survive. Kino. What happened? Quiet. Chrono rest. North wood burning. Uh oh. Okay, so I'm just going to stop here because this is basically it. Unfortunately, I wonder where Magus went. I'm actually, I really don't know. But anyways, thanks for watching episode 14, if I'm right. Anyways, um, yeah. Thanks for watching episode 14 of Let's Play Walkthrough Chrono, Chrono Trigger. I keep trying to say Chrono Cross for some reason. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I am going to play Chrono Cross later on. Eventually. So yeah, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next episode.